it doesn't particularly bother me if they've got it. I just don't go out of my way to get that. Um, Kangaroo's got inspired trading. So that's good. Was that trading? Or Are you sure about that? I'm not. I'm not sure. I, I just literally like, the fuck did that come up with? She frenzy that kangaroo. Taming. It was taming. I thought it was trading. To what is it? The toes. Toes are the best. Which you? No. They come pre jammed, Grim. You don't add jammed toes. Jesus. Like, if you got jammed to spare, man, like, I'm not going to pass up, but. <laughs> oh, man. You guys just wait until I get my fucking OnlyFans situation going. My, um, that, that's a, that's a long, long situation going down there is, um, I'll be, I'll be drawing my, like, Kelly Venus myself, right, um, in, like, suggested poses and stuff on OnlyFans. I just have to figure out how the fuck OnlyFans works. <laughs> Once I've got that down pat, though, eventually there'll be some spicy content. Ah, Boomalip Revenge. And it's raining, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah. I don't know. Eventually there'll be stuff discreetly put up there. Um, got medicine growing wild. <laughs> uh, did you miss something, Blessed? Or, or did you come back uh, during an interesting part of a conversation? Oh, man. Uh, masterwork. Rejo has created birds and pants. Nice. At least somebody's got good pants. Um, we're doing okay for food. We've got all these animals and stuff that have just culled. So all my goats, all the turkeys, uh, some wild game, stuff like that. Um, I'm still trying not to take people on because I've got 128 beds in this place, but I've got 120 people. And uh, some of them are in relationships with not all of them are in the double bed situation. So, yeah. It, it helps when they kind of double up. But yeah, I'm going to... Because they're going pretty good. I think they'll do most of that harvest. So I'm going to send out a caravan. Who did I... Only says... Restocked, yes. Oh my god. That one actually took me by surprise. I wasn't expecting anything then. Um, restocked. Suggestive anthropomorphic raccoons. Oh my god. Um, is this one? Yes, they all are. Thank you for the 500 bits rest. Um, Jesus Christ, like. I nearly got a more suggestive picture of fucking Jeff Bob Coldbloom, but I'm glad that I kind of like kept it tamer, <laughs> considering how like like how much it's like popping up though. I'm gonna head maybe down this way. I, I don't nearly I don't need to stop there, but it's good that it's there. Um, I don't actually know who my cooks are. Why are you bleeding? Okay, you're bleeding. Does this is the only thing I haven't done before as I well, I don't bother to do usually is I kind of want to take somebody that's not plants and I don't really need somebody to be with guns. I just want somebody that's not a cook and not on my plants duties because I need them to stay home. Animals, maybe. Um, what about Chris? Chris, how do you feel about traveling? How do you feel about that? Because that looks like where you're going. I don't need too many people. I just need, like, you and... Where the fuck is Corpsey? He's probably, like, at the top of the list. Um... Corpsey... There you are. Holy shit, that was a bit of a look and a half. Okay, so that's 70 kilos for two people. I know Corpsey does other stuff. But I need him to go on the trip because he's got all the social. So I need him to go regardless. But I really don't want to take many people out of here. Um, my animal list has gone down. I've still got guinea pigs. They're not culling them properly. Oh, they're pregnant. That's right. It'll have to wait until they 
Man, that's morbid. They give birth, and then my people come out and slaughter the guinea pig and the baby. So, <laughs> double the meat, though. Fucking hell. Some of the stuff they do. Questionable. All right, let's send out... I'm just going to send out, like, a fair few pack animals for this. I'm going to send out whatever kind of, like, monies, skins, whatever we've got. Um... Is it stocks? I I know, right? It's it's basically like that. I think of the meme stonks, you know, with the the guy with his arms folded with like the chart behind him. That's what I'm thinking. It's basically true. How much we got here? Four thousand. I could do more. Uh five thousand. Like I doubt that they'd ever hit. Well. I lie. I know they could hit that if they tried hard enough. But if I took out like five, five to six, I'm gonna go for six if I've got it. I don't know if I've got it. Ooh, actually, I might. This is taking every pulling animal out. There's six. All right, we don't need that many. There we go. Six, pretty much, kind of neat-ish. Close enough. Close enough is good enough. They're going to have a great time getting that out with two people. It's going to take a while to stock up. Okay, so we've got a day of food and I'm kind of like, I want you guys to go pretty far. I am going to let you guys take a couple bedrolls for once. I would like them to be semi-comfortable. Take three and probably three, just well, five in case some shit goes down. Not like I could really defend them in that event do that mm. wait I'll I know I've got like a fair bit of food I'll actually take it from this one up here that'll be better all right let's go about what that that is a minus bar not a zero all right 26 days maybe enough that's a lot of food that two people have to pack in there's a good chance one of them's gonna have like a mental break I'll pop in about 200 of this. This will really bump that up. Uh, can we do... What's the, can we do a poll to see if we can get suggested prawns? Um, I wouldn't even know what to do with that. Both the poll and the prawns. <laughs> um, I have... I already have some... I would call it reference material for like the poses that I'd like to put her in. Um, and not, obviously I'm not releasing those till like I've drawn them and stuff, but it's going to take a bit for me to draw it. That's why I am working on doing like some drawing streams and stuff like that, because it will get my skill level back up. And I have, I haven't drawn enough to have like that nice kind of skill level that I want for that kind of content. Um, but I know that at some point in the future, that kind of content will be asked for, and I don't really have any kind of problem with it. So um, I might as well kind of like plan for it, so to speak. As for the raccoon style stuff, um, I hadn't even thought about like like theme stuff actually. Like that kind of stuff had not crossed my mind, which is interesting because like you know uh, I'm not I'm not devoid of the internet. I know the content that exists in the adult realms, and uh, I should be more aware of this shit. But yeah, not apparently. Not seasoned enough in, in many different ways. That could be taken a lot of different ways, actually. Um, yeah, take all the silver. Actually, leave leave the 800 or so here. I probably don't have enough if somebody comes through um, to actually buy something at home. But I'll just see if I can throw maybe one more person that's not animals and not... I don't want a night person because I'm pretty sure the two people I've got are daytimes. What do you do? You do cooking. I don't want to cook. I don't want a gardener. I'm pretty sure you're a hunter. You do plants. But you, Tofu, what the fuck do you do these days? Cooking. All right. Fair, fair call. Tofu's actually been really good. I, I have to admit, like, Tofu's been on his best fucking behavior compared to last time. Uh... No phrasing. It's it's always inappropriate. Plants and animals. 
Trust me, if I'm saying something and it's inappropriate, I've either weighed up the pros and cons of saying it or I'm fucking oblivious. <laughs> it's A or it's B and it's it's never in between. Like, I, I normally even know what I'm doing or I'm not. Uh, plants? No. Jesus Christ, I have a lot of people with plants. You don't? Hello. Omen, how do you feel about travel? You got a fucking... Me, you got, you've got the masterwork. Holy shit. Yeah, all right. I'll have a fair chance at that, and I think I'll grab you an extra bedroll. Spoilt. These guys are just pure spoilt. I'm giving them a fucking bedroll to take with them. The luxuries. Yeah, so I'm gonna head, like, down here. Then probably work my way back up. Probably have to go to that, then, like, this or something like that. If I wanted to, I could always send them over here. There's a great deal of, like, little places over here I could visit. That I haven't gone to yet, but I think... Where does this one go from here? They can go to this, but I think they would have to go all the way down and around here. Because this line here, this little dark line, is a solid mountain. So they can't go over it. That's the only downside. I sometimes forget that when I send them for travel. And I send them in the wrong direction first. Because I'm not actually expecting them to go that way. I'm expecting them to go through where I've sent them, but then they end up going like the long way around. Well, it's spring, finally. Psychic Soothe is for females, which is great because the last one that was like psychic, what do you call it? What's the one that sends them psychotic? Whatever that was, sent um, Rose Wild. We have so much crop. All the animals are eating the crops too. I don't really mind that. I did harp like I did put them there with the view that they would get that, and a percentage of the harvest would go up into their area. What are you doing, Phoenix? You come for patrol, have you? You push the door wide open though. It's cold in here. And you're fucking freezing, Jesus Christ! Phoenix is like a low, uh, fat density kind of breed of cat, so he gets really cold. You cannot. You cannot sit up there. I know what you're trying to do. He thinks he's going to sit across like my chest and that's not going to happen. I can't sit that way while I'm streaming. Oh, yaks. Hold up. I want yaks. Uh, tell us show when Rose goes wild. You know what? I should have fucking made it. I should have made last week's one that. That's fantastic. I was trying to think of something... I try not to make like clickbaity titles because like, I don't want people to come in and be like, oh, this isn't what I came here for. But like, I tried to think of something that was like on the borderline for tonight. And I'm like, obviously, I didn't do that great with like titles and shit. But I mean, occasionally I get there. Occasionally I get something that like is just like too, too perfect not to say that particular thing. Like, I've had some, I've had some interesting ones. That's right, I was putting double walls on everything I could, and doors. We got attacked by... Wargs. That's what happened. I didn't get a chance to put the extra doors and shit. I, I don't need to be putting extra doors and stuff around here, but... I know that it helps. It helps, like, insulate stuff a little bit. You love the joke titles. See, the thing is, um, the stream titles allow you to have, like, a reasonably long title, right? So there's plenty of options. However, the thing is that only the first 24 letters can actually be seen in a search when you're scrolling. Uh, cargo pods, sweet. And steel. That's wart, by the way, so I can make stuff with that if people pick it up fast enough. Yeah, so when I make a, a stream title, I've got to be considerate of the fact that even though I've got up to, I think, 50, 50 characters or something like that, only half of that is visible when somebody's scrolling through. So if I've got, like, if I was to uh, swap my title around tonight, like, Impossible or Not, Retaming Rose, like, most people would only see the Impossible or Not Retaming. Um, and for most people that know RimWorld, that would not be a question of yes or no. That's a yes um, in most cases. So, yeah. It's it's really interesting, like, learning how to do stuff like that. It's really, really interesting. The other thing I'm trying to learn how to do is set up a fucking hype train because 
Um, I don't know how people get, like, all their, like, you know how you get, like, confetti and shit like that and all sorts of shit go off? Like, I don't know how to set up that stuff. I'm trying to watch tutorials, but I'll tell you what, there's not much out there for it. So, I, I wish. I wish there was more information. Like, I'm actually keen to, like, make some information myself once I figure it out, but the point is, I actually have to figure it out. Um, I've got so much stuff coming in. Once most of these animals are out of here, by the way, these cropped areas, if they regrow before it gets too cold, I might actually get a second crop out of some of these. Especially this one, because they're tying them up all the way over there. So whatever's not going, I think there's more to go. I think they're still, like, rounding them all up because there's only three. Yeah, they've only put like a little bit of stuff in them. But almost almost all of these animals are going. Except for a couple of yaks. I didn't miss a couple of yaks. Are you guys juveniles? No, you're an adult. Might have been a juvenile when I selected it, maybe. And it's just changed over now. Um Hmm. Doesn't matter. I'll, I'll definitely get more crop out of this. What's wrong, Phoenix? I know you're cold. You got your little blankie. Phoenix is just standing in his bed. Like, he's not even bothering to lay down. He's just like, it's cold. I'm uncomfortable. And I'm like, man, I know. And Zula's, on the other hand, she's like 100% snuggled into her. So she's really warm as. Yeah, the food production for the animals is going fucking good. Thousand odd potatoes. Wait, 11,000 fucking potatoes. 4,000 rice. If the air conditioners and stuff were working a bit better, that would be good. Refrigerated. Pipe train happens without you setting it up. Nearly 80% sure. Two people starting it together, sub spits. Um, yeah, no, I, un I understand that side of it. I know that it happens automatically when something happens, but to have it automatically happen, you have to have all the settings set up and enabled. That's the part that I didn't have. Same with like the bitches. I didn't have any of those set up. I had to uh, do that manually. Um, and that involves uh, either finding a GIF with sound or a GIF and a sound, hoping that the sound isn't copyright protected and then working on like layouts, arrangements, names, stuff like that, all that kind of thing. Um, and same with the hype train. Oh, shut up, Grim. I said I'm, I'm working on it. The hype train stuff, I've got to look up. Um, like, at the moment, as far as I could tell, it would only, whatever I pick to, like, display and stuff, I think only appears in that little window where the bit shear happens. Um, whereas I've seen streamers have it on their entire screen. And I don't know how to do that. Um, or, like, interesting graphics. Like, I know one person, uh, Sylvixen, has... Uh, characters walk down the bottom and as each like tier happens she gets more characters walking down the bottom stuff like that like i think that's cool i think that'd be really cool to do but um yeah i i just need to find when the information is i figure if people have done it it's doable i just need to figure it out that's basically been my method for everything i've done so far absolutely everything i've learned about streaming is if it if somebody can has done it it can be done and i if I try hard enough, I can find how to do it as well. Or at least, like, figure it out by observing. I'm actually really good at doing that. <laughs> Is um, If I observe something for long enough, I can work it out, usually. Um, that's just one of those, like, special... I'm going to just say special mindsets, but it's actually, like, something I think I got from, like, working in computers back in the day. Uh, Jet's pegging out because he's got food binge. It's fine. Well, these guys aren't doing too badly. They're not in the best spot. Like, they've still got access to some food. At worst case scenario, I would open up this for them. What are you doing in there? And you're definitely not supposed to be in there. I think somebody's let that one in. Doesn't matter. It's not like he's going to starve. Like, that's generally the concern. I have... I guess the only thing that's frustrating with this game is I can't set up that 10 animals can't go into a certain area. 
if they get out. I have to rely on somebody actually getting that out of there. These. I missed turning these off. And I bit my tongue. Fuck's sake. I don't know how I did that in that sentence, but I bit my fucking tongue. I fucking bit it good too. Ugh. Yeah, so I'm working on these watermill generators as well. I didn't actually realize that I could put them on this map because this waterway is so tiny, but it might work. It might generate a little bit of electricity and it showed up green, so I should be able to put them there. My only problem is, well, I have the wood to build most of these because, you know, trees. The problem that I've got is that I don't have the components in the steel. I actually have components, but nobody's putting them in places, but I don't have steel for sure. That's something I'm pretty much completely out of. We would have just got some steel from the steel chunks that came in off that cargo pod. Actually, now that I've got wart, I wonder, did I have this set up already? This is the brewery. Make wart. I've got that. I just, I'm not growing wart yet, I don't think. I'm growing hops. Make medicine. What else does... I flish years in a days. What else makes... Yeah, no, that one only makes that. I thought the drug lab made stuff from it. I thought it made beer and stuff. Maybe it just doesn't. As far as I understand, they should... Oh, yeah, this one's got stuff in it. Oh, a couple of them do. This one's... Let's see. Ideal fermenting temperature. Progress is 8.8, 8.9. Got five days left, and it's 21 degrees. Oh, purple hair. All right, yeah. Hold up. Um, and I'll see if I can get it to change. Wait, where is my program? There it is. No. <laughs> she, she keeps doing this. The state six. There we go. I almost hit the exit. <laughs> um, and hydrate. Nice. I was kind of like semi sipping on an almost cold coffee. It's very unsatisfying at this point. I do have my water in here though. It's interesting because when I get up, it's not long before I start streaming. I actually rely on while I'm streaming to drink the water for like, you know, the first like few hours of my day kind of thing. So yeah, last night I actually got through a leader. It was pretty good by the end of the stream, whereas tonight I'm just starting. It's good that like I'll zoom in a bit because I know it's very hard to see if you're on a mobile. But you can just barely see this little line here, whereas these barrels don't have it. So these ones have got wort in it and they're fermenting. So I should get beer out of these. And when that happens, I'll have beer in my food storage. And then I have to just keep my eye on the cats. Um, I noticed in the past that the cats, like the, the fucking pet cats, these cats, they drink the beer and then they get fucking... What is it? Cirrhosis or something like that. I think it is. Yeah. So just gotta keep an eye on that because last time I had beer in the base, I ended up with completely slosh cats like almost all the time. Start. You are never working on anything. Lou's hiding in his room. Because awful bedroom. Guys, your bedrooms aren't that bad. All right, come on. Where is Star? You. I don't know. Okay, so you... Yeah, she can go on a fire starting street. That's fine. Look, this chick is like almost never working. I'm just going to raise up basically everything so that she does shit at some point. Because she shouldn't be not doing anything. Who's the other one? Worm. Okay, that's new. Where is Worm? Yeah, you. What do you do? You do handling... Cooking. Okay, there's rolling blackouts. That could be an issue. What else do you do? You do mining. I don't have anything to mine. You do hunting a little bit. Let's bring that priority up a bit. And you don't really do much else. Let's see, low construction. There is some construction around the base. I'm just going to figure out where the fuck weapons are. And see if I can get some people like saddled with a weapon or something. 
I think that's half of my problem. So I've got a lot of statues in here. That's really good. Okay, so weapons. Why is Lou the first on the... Oh, sorry, that's not Lou. That's Lumi. Uh, if it was you, you'd make a separate fridge, which certainly drinks, forbid the animals, uh, remove the allowed area. I did have that. My only thing is that I actually have to kind of pick a spot for that to happen for storage. I also need, I want to find out if it requires refrigeration because I literally can't remember. I think maybe it does. And then I'm thinking that I've had stuff in storage before like that that didn't. So maybe it doesn't. I'm just going to get people some fucking guns. I think when my base got attacked that time, not you. Uh, Chris is having a tantrum. When my base got attacked, I think everybody dropped their guns. I don't give a fuck about Chris. Get rid of the notification. Excuse you? Oh, no. You are not touching that. Fucking good on you, though. Way to... Way to get yourself handed. You did not destroy those. I can't rebuild them. Somebody get in here quick before the thing gets fully destroyed. He will just stand there until that is destroyed. Good. Everybody's everybody's had a punch on? Fantastic. That's a colony at work. And he's right in the medical ward, so he'll be right. Probably. Where's your health? Death in six hours. So he'll be right. He's right next to hospital bed. <laughs> yeah, you just don't touch stuff in my base. Uh, let's see. Is anybody going to pick him up? I'm kind of expecting one of these guys to maybe pick him up. Doesn't deserve the treatment. Look, mate, nobody's picking him up. Can you come over here and rescue him? Before he just, like, lays there and dies. Like a champ. Delacruz is having a, um, tantrum because recreationally deprived. Death in six hours. I'm going to keep an eye on you because nobody's tending. I don't know, whenever somebody touches something like going to be hard to replace, expensive or impossible to replace or whatever, right? I just don't stand around and wait for them to punch on until it's gone if, I, if I'm aware of it. Look, Lumi, who's... Nobody's tending to... I know everybody had a good like punch off, but like at least somebody gave him a fucking healing pack or something. <laughs> oh my god, bless. Don't don't touch the stuff. I'll zoom out so you can't be touching the stuff. Somebody's having a social fight. See, somebody got a punch on. They knew they knew that the stuff was being touched, that's what happened. Why are these guinea pigs still alive? Ah, oh, okay, people are slaughtering them as we speak. Yeah, somebody must have given birth. Oh my god, are you guys fucking finished? Right, back to allocating guns. Because I think I was up to Cypress. Yeah. yeah. The only other place I could think of that might be good to maybe store something like beer um, that I could probably exclude an area or something like that might be in like this area. Or like this one where I've got like a little bit of extra space. Kind of like this. It just means that they have to take it somewhere. Like, if it's going to be a hot area, I might put it down into something like this because they'll be, like, far enough away from, like, food and anything kind of useful, like, even storage and stuff. I could, if it doesn't require refrigeration, I could easily put it in here and just say cats aren't allowed in here and problem solved, basically, as long as they actually stay out of there. Um, but if it is... If it is refrigerable, if it's got to be refrigerable, I'll probably have to make it somewhere else because the cats need to get in here for the meat. That's the only problem. If I don't do that, they will hunt whatever's on the map. There is only so much ever available on the map because I have so many predators. All right, Cyprus, I know you're chilling. What kind of gun? You are a pacifist going out on this. Interesting. Well, that's certainly something. Melee. Alright. 
It's interesting though, if I hadn't sent out a caravan, I probably wouldn't know that a good portion of my people aren't actually carrying weapons. So a lot of the time, they drop stuff and I just don't notice. That one should be available. I want to leave that masterwork for somebody that's got something a bit higher than that. You have a weapon, but one. You don't. Hmm. Somehow this is so much more relaxed than um than seven days. <laughs> uh, even though like everybody's like you're micromanaging so many people and stuff, but it's like it's a relaxing kind of game. Interestingly enough. Uh okay, so one person going on that caravan's getting a gun. For 10. Reserved by 